Oh, we're quite backlit today, but hi, good morning. I am in, oh, we better not do that. I am in Milton Keynes, and someone reversing into me. No, not good. Um, I'm in Milton Keynes today. I'm going to go shopping. I'm going to go in Primark is the main-ish, and 50% off food starts today in, like, restaurants. So I might go to a restaurant and I'm wearing this, I've got very like dad on holiday vibes outfit on today. Um, I didn't realise how floral that is, it's quite bright but whatever. I am going into Primark, I'm going to come sh- sh- come shop with me, I'm going to show you what's good, what's popping in Primark. I don't think there's very much but I did watch Mr Carrington's vlog, Ewan's um, vlog the other day and there's a lot of sale stuff at the moment so that's good and fun which there wasn't really that much last time we came here was there. So yeah. Come shop with me today. Show me up the escalators. We're into the wellness section. I've seen this on some other people's vlogs, like um, Miss Budget Beauties. Come shop with me. I love hers. This is what inspired this whole series. But this wellness section, very like ESOP vibes in terms of the glass amber jars and stuff. Um, and like the whole vibe is just at home, like pandemic essentials loungewear heaven and they've got some nice uni sets hoodies here for 14 pounds they look very lightweight of course i didn't touch them but they look lightweight nice for summer now homeware is something that i don't normally venture into i like this whole smile thing that's quite nice and then this hedgehog thing made me laugh it's an led color changing hedgehog my sister loves hedgehogs i should have bought her that one for my niece and i hot like this whole color palette i really like that throw actually with the tassels now has anyone had um primark bedding jersey bedding is not something that i would be down for because i think i'd get too hot these wireless headphones i was really tempted by they were 22 pounds so i wasn't sure about it because that's a bit steep for something that might not work moving on to men's section there's a lot of shirts in this um because they were selling them off on sale this one i really did like but i don't think it's for me both of these were five pounds this section was quite a vibe um and then you will see just now that there's a bag there that was very can't remember the name how do you say farrokan you know the brand beginning with f it's got the whole handle thing you can't see my hand i'm well aware of that but i'm doing the movement okay um then that some car i haven't gone into cargo pants but i would quite like those now this bag i saw on mr carrington's vlog um a vlog even seven pounds linen trousers i was really tempted at these at 14 pounds and they really did some nice colors but is that a bit too old man dad on holiday vibes with like sock and sandals but that is kind of a thing linen blend was everywhere these were really nice shirts that's quite a nice pajama shirt actually but it's not pajama it's meant to look like one like boy in striped pajamas these shirts were not 12 pound they were nine and they're like minuscule floral print they're really quite nice but i didn't pick any up because shirts coming out of my ears at the moment but a lot of linen blend shirts around this section um this is a nice white one i believe that was 10 pounds and then this shirt who remembers like 2009 was it everyone had like sparrow print and it wasn't that was a trend for like a long time like sparrow birds this shirt i've got you've seen it in my previous haul linked up above um and then this was quite a nice one at eight pounds as the black linen shirt now this one was like minuscule pattern of the shirt that i've got which was very interesting moving on to a whole wall of shirts and most of them are linen blend slash 100 percent cotton this one was really quite nice was that eight pounds did that say um a nice relaxed fit nice for a summer or just hot weather that we're having here at the moment um and more like 100% cotton now this linen shirt i should have bought i really like that color looking it back on the camera it's a really nice raspberry pink now this shirt i wasn't too sure about and i hadn't seen it before it's not linen blend i don't think i think it said 100% cotton for nine pounds not sure about it it looked like weather symbols from the like cloudy looking things that's its style tell me what you think about that um then moving on to shoes now these boots i do need some more boots because my primate ones are kind of flaking and going bad inside but look how bad those ones are the display ones not nice they're 20 quid as well these um boot um not boots what are these trainers really like those these were 12 pounds um yeah kind of like 
smart trainers and these had memory foam in I'm not sure about that that might be like walking on clouds i suppose and then i think i went back to the boots because i'm really really tempted to buy those but they looked really hard these i also saw on mr carrington's video um some nice slip on like hermes knockoffs for 10 euros it said so i'm guessing 10 pounds and these were really nice um at new balance for 20 dupes they were seven pound i believe really liked the nice greeny color and they did some nice black and beige ones i kind of miss the beige ones i like the beige ones these made me laugh these are like knockoff gucci that they call instead they were six pounds really like these shorts they're very similar to ones that i've got from bershka but with an elasticated waist bershka ones don't have that and then some really nice shorts so none of them were in my size hey guys so i've just got back from Milton Keynes, quite warm. Now, I say I just got back, I went to my parents first because I did buy some things for my niece and nephew. I bought a t-shirt in Primark. I haven't got that anymore because my mum has like a wardrobe in her house for stuff that are for them in like future times. But I bought um, a t-shirt in Primark, which is just pink. So it's got a bit of boredom glaze on it. Um, for £1.80 and then in H&M I really got this really nice dress in the sale which was a collaboration which I can't remember I saw it a while ago like last year last summer I think I saw it which is palm prints with actual like pictures of animals like giraffes and zebras and stuff on it which was reduced to £2 it was only 2 99 to begin with but it went down to £2 and then I bought her a um black polka dot dress which was black polka dot and it's just got like a little bow on the front that was four pounds i also went in jewels and got them got my nephew a little checked shirt for nine pound 95 and my niece a blue t-shirt for six pound 95 or something like that but anyway I this is what's left that I got for myself really not much because I didn't want to overdo it you saw in the come shop with me part video part of the video there was a lot of sale stuff um in Primark but a lot of them were shirts but if you saw my previous haul from H&M you know I don't need any shirts because I bought three last week but I had to get another shirt um I can get it out this was totally inspired by Mr. Carrington. I'll link his channel below. Um, if you like my kind of videos, you'll definitely like his, and he's just hit 50k, which is amazing. This was five pounds instead of 10, and it is, oh, it's 100% cotton. They had a lot of linen blend stuff in Primark, which is really nice for the summer. I was tempted to buy some linen shirts, and they, if you saw them in the shop with me, they were 10 pounds. I think nine or ten between eight and ten pounds for like short sleeve linen shirts which is quite nice um but this is very thin it's got a granddad collar um and it's like pink stripe it's coming like orangey on the camera i suppose it's like a very it's like a salmony pink kind of thing can you see um and this was originally ten pound it was part of the chem x Primark collection now was he a love island person i think so um totally gone past my head but it's actually long sleeve but it does have like I know that's not focused but you can roll them down or roll them up I'd probably wear this kind of thing roll up because it's kind of like a summer thing um, and I'm hot all the time but it's got button there to hold it up if you are rolling it up and it comes like three quarters of the way down that was the only thing I got for me in a um, Primark even. In H&M I actually got something for myself. Now these were, I have got the beige version of these and I've been wearing them quite a lot because they're a relaxed fit, they're linen blend which is perfect for summer and they're just so comfortable. They are relaxed but I'm kind of liking that dad on holiday vibe with the relaxedness it's kind of in like wide leg rather than like shorts um wide leg rather than like skin tight and skin tight is so uncomfortable and i just can't be dealing with uncomfortableness 
just can't. Um, so these were originally, where's the tag? These were originally 19.99 and I got them for seven. And they are just a navy short, which is quite long. You can, can you see for it? Yes, you can. You can see for it. So it's quite light, quite nice for summer because I didn't want to wear those ones out that I've got. It's got an elasticated waist and it's also got drawstring, but as well as a, um, which is nice. Because sometimes when it's elasticated waist and that's all the elastic in, it is, but this has got popper and then a zip bit as well, which is good. So yeah, that was really nice. I suppose them together would be quite nice actually. Yeah, might do that. So that's them. I'm not going to do a try on bit for that because it's literally just a long sleeve shirt and shorts. I think we know what they look like. So yeah, hope you guys are all well. Thank you for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed the little cum shop with me at the beginning. Originally it was going to be a cum shop with me and then a haul. I have not bought enough for myself for a haul. Um, I could have showed you all the baby stuff but I don't think that's what people really want because the last one I did of that just on its own didn't do very well. So <laughs> um, that kind of content I will steer away from. So I hope you guys are really well. Thank you so much for watching. Um, yeah subscribe if you haven't already and um, leave a nice comment down below and um, follow me on my instagrams as well they're always linked below and i'll see you in my next video bye